Today's video, a fan has requested me to do a theory on Pokemon Weeping Bell. I have received some feedback, though, from fans asking me for more theories about other generations. And while I do have some theories coming up on other generations, feel free to submit your own. I, however, grew up with Kanto and Johto as my Pokemon games, and thus my knowledge is most extensive for those Pokemon generations. But taking the suggestions, I will be looking into different generations besides good old Kanto. So sign in and get ready to comment down below as we explore the grass Pokemon, Weeping Bell. The theory today is that Weeping Bell's design is based and inspired from Krusty the Clown. If you are not familiar with Krusty the Clown, it is a character from the popular series called The Simpsons. Now before you instantly write this off as ridiculous, let's all remember that Pokemon is inspired by real world events, animals, insects, and important media structures of the time. Just look at Kadabra being based off of a real world psychic from the 90s, and Caterpie is based off of a real world insect. And Arcanine is based off of the Shisa Okinawa Guardian, and there are many more. So Weeping Bell and Krusty the Clown, a very odd comparison. Physically, they look similar due to the designs. Weeping Bell's eyes are more dilated, and Krusty has a nose as well, but I can kind of see the similarity in it. However, after researching quite a bit into the popularity of Simpsons in Japan, it turns out that it's not at all popular. There are multiple posts on four discussing in detail why, and though it was shown over there, I highly doubt that an unpopular show would have had an influence on the development of Pokemon. Even more so, Krusty is a side character, which the developers might not have even seen. I have discussed in the past where I think certain shows like Sailor Moon influenced the development of certain characters like James, however I think this is not the case with Weeping Bell. In fact, I know Victory Bell is designed off of a tropical pitcher plant, which lures insects inside of it with a sweet scent and then traps it and digests it with acid. And wouldn't you know it, Victory Bell is not only a one-to-one -one look alike, but it also is a grass poison type that learns not only sweet scent, but also through Weeping Bell, acid. I speculate that Victory Bell was designed off of that tropical pitcher plant, and then Weeping Bell and Bell Sprout were designed after. Many pre-alpha art renditions support this, showing Pokemon like Rhydon being designed before its previous evolution, Rhyhorn. Again, I can understand where someone might see the similarity, but after a bit of research, I just don't think The Simpsons was popular enough to influence the developers in making Weeping Bell. So ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoy me exploring the origins of certain Pokemon, leave me a like and let me know what my next theory should be. Thanks for watching, and I've been your host, Proto Mario, and I'm signing out. As always, good gaming, and God bless.